welcome everyone. It's a great day being the first day of spring. Hopefully all the wind and rain has left us. It's been a really cold winter. And uh, I'd just like to uh, uh, just acknowledge that it's our fourth walk with me this year. And uh, it's all about celebrating social inclusion for uh, people with varying abilities in Australia. And I think we, as a society we do that very, very well in Australia. We've got some special guests with us here today. And firstly, I'd just like to uh, acknowledge the presence of the uh, Lord Mayor of Adelaide, um, the Honourable Stephen uh, Yarwood and his family, and thank them for coming. They'll be, he'll be coming up shortly to say a few words and officially launching uh, Walk With Me with our client ambassadors as well. But we've got some other special guests. We have the Honourable Tony Piccolo, the Minister for Disability. He's here representing uh, himself, but also the um, uh, Premier, who sends his best regards. We have Dr Duncan McFetrich, the, uh, the opposition spokesman for disabilities, and he's also representing the opposition leader, uh, um, um, Stephen uh, Marshall. We've also got Kelly Vincent, MLC Dignity for Disability. And as uh, Trent said, we've got the Central District's uh, Football Club, they played a fantastic game yesterday. Uh, they've been with us for the four years and they're doing their cool down today. Uh, I think they won by about 63 points and uh, raised about $7,000 for our organisation as well. The boys were a bit concerned about wearing their yellow boots to signify their uh, support of Novita yesterday, but we think those yellow boots caused that win, so that was fantastic. We've got our five client ambassadors here as well. Some of them have been with us since the start. That's Archie, Morgan, Riley, Tanner and uh, Eddie and they'll be helping the Lord Mayor launch uh, Walk With Me shortly. We've also got some Paralympians and para-athletes who were all clients of Novita Children's Services in the past and are great role models for the kids. Um, and their names are Jesse Ungles, Nathan Arkley and Braden Davison. I would like to acknowledge um, our new national sponsor because this is a national walk and there's walks occurring right around Australia and that's uh, Dick Smith's, and I'd like to welcome their area manager, David Gauchy. Now, being a retail store, a lot of the staff are working today, being a Sunday, but uh, if the Dick Smith staff could just wave their hands and make a, make a bit of noise. <laughs> Wonderful. So everyone say uh, thanks to Dick Smith, and uh, any, electrical, any electrical or technology purchases go to Dick Smith. I'd like to also thank our local sponsors, you know, fantastic sponsorship from Bank SA, as I said before, Central District Football Club, uh, the wonderful Mix 102.3 that you've been enjoying their barbecue, uh, which they'll start cooking shortly, and the music, and budget rent a car, of course. So um, it, it's a wonderful uh, day today to celebrate uh, social inclusion. I want to just say a special hello and happy Father's Day to the dads, granddads, and the potentially some great granddads out there as well, and we thank them for sharing their special day with us as well. So I'll just ask for the client ambassadors to come forward, and they are forward, and I'll uh, now like to introduce uh, the uh, Right Honourable, the Lord Mayor of Adelaide, Stephen Yarwood, to officially launch uh, Walk With Me for 2013. Thanks. I just want to make some important big day comments about the really significant, important significance of social inclusion and that's uh, what Novita's here for today and really want to tip my hat uh, to what they're doing. They're doing a fantastic job and to bring such a big crowd out on a, on a beautiful day like this on Father's Day is something that's really fantastic. Just a quick show of hands, who's got a smartphone on them today? Come on, stick your hands up. Well, you guys have actually got a job to do. Don't just go for a walk. Get your phone out, whether it's Twitter and it's at Novita Star. Most of you, I bet, are on Facebook and there is a Facebook page for Novita Children's Services and that's what you need to search. Get it out, take a few moments to like the page, to actually put it up on your Facebook page. I reckon there's a lot of people on a Sunday who are sitting in front of their computer or out having a coffee looking at their Facebook page right now. So if every single one of you get out there and spread that word, we can triple, we can quadruple the number of people that can be aware of what's happening in this park today. So my job is not asking what Novita can do for you, but what you can do for Novita. Get your phone out, promote the event, and make sure that more people are aware of the issue. It's great to see so many people here today to do two things. One is raise awareness of uh, children living with disability, but also raising funds for Novita. And uh, improving the quality of life for, for children is what Novita is all about. 
uh, not only the children, but also helping and supporting their families. And they've been doing this since 1939, and so Novita are an important part of like our, our community to support young children living with disability. Now, Dr. Duncan McPetridge, our Shadow Minister for Health, Disabilities and Community Services, who is also representing the Leader of Opposition, Stephen Marshall. Thanks, Trent. Good morning, everyone. And isn't it a wonderful day to be out here with Navita? I'm here with my grandchildren, Lily and Harry, and we are going to do what we can to support Navita today. And every day, Navita's out there doing good work for us. The sponsors have turned it on today, and let's hope we can turn it on for Navita. As uh, the Minister said, and as the Mayor said, Novita are out there, they're doing it, they're doing it every day for all these kids and for their parents and for the broader community.